Was there any time as well that other uh, members of the Do government at the time visited a prison, like the civilian um, uh, cabinet ministers? Did any of these guys visit, like uh, Tipote, did Bacchus Matthew, George Bode, Chia Chipo, did any of them visit the prison during this time when these people were incarcerated before some of them were executed? Madam Commissioner, never to my knowledge, I don't recall, I don't remember. Uh, if that happened, I think I, uh, I would have retained that memory. But to that specific question, I never, for the duration of my assignment there, never saw George Bully, never saw Tipote, uh, never saw who else you asked, uh, um, Gabriel, Mark, uh, Michael Matthew, no man. I never. Okay, part two, that's uh, the last part of my question. It has been rumored that in the early days of the coup, when um, these civilian um, um, activists joined the government, you know, a lot of them were incorporated as ministers, and some of them were also advisors to the PRC. Um, do you know anything about a couple of them having a list of, of um, former Torbal officials who were supposed to be picked up, incarcerated, or held responsible for what had happened to the country? Do you know if they had lists and who were on the list? And why were they um, making lists of people? Were they targeting people and why? And whether some of these people on the list are those, are amongst those who were executed, like the 13 government officials? I did hear rumors as to uh, when it comes to specifically about the 13 officials, uh, uh, cabinet members that were arrested. Uh, but before I stretch on that, uh, a lot of the people, according to what I saw, and uh, keep in mind that I was later on asked to come back to work after a while, so I, I didn't know a whole lot that was, that was going on. And then besides, we were being uh, ourselves, trying to protect ourselves, or myself, uh, for so many reasons. So I didn't try to poke into a lot of things. 